Animal shelters across Harris County have been dealing with issues of overcrowding for months, and now they're preparing for a potential surge in homeless pets as we get into the thick of spring. KPRC2 anchor Andy Sirota is in the newsroom with the details. Andy? Hi, Christine. Animal overpopulation is a year-round problem in Harris County, but spring is when the weather conditions are most ideal for many animals to breed including cats and dogs. The Harris County Pets Resource Center now over capacity and even with its partnerships with area animal rescue groups, there is still an urgent need for help. I feel like we're always in a crisis. Local animal rescue groups will be the first to tell you the homeless pet population in Harris County seems to be worse here than anywhere else because they're in the trenches. They see and deal with it every day. The problem has gone unchecked for so long. It's just the resources have not been um, utilized in order to get the populations under control. Houston Pet Set partners with Harris County by moving rescued animals from Houston to Minnesota. Today, county leaders urging citizens to foster and adopt as the county's newest animal shelter exceeds capacity. Since the first of the year, they've taken in just under 2,900 animals. Over 400 are at the facility now. There is an urgent need for dog adoptions. An overcrowded shelter stretches resources thin. It puts extra burden not just on the staff, but also on our furry friends. While they recognize the county's efforts, Houston Petset says the public plea for adoptions is like putting a Band-Aid on a wound. What's really needed? Massive accessible spay and neuter, education, legislation, and more resources from the city and county. The nonprofits that we work with spend $67 million a year. The city and the county spend $19 million combined. And this isn't a slam on BARC. This isn't a slam on the people that work there. This is a call for help. Mm -hmm. This is a call for more resources. If you're concerned about the expenses that come with adopting a dog or cat. The center's director says Harris County Pets can help with vaccinations. If you can't adopt, they're always looking for volunteers and donations. Live in the newsroom tonight, Andy Sirota, KPRC 2 News. Andy, thank you. Still